Hey everybody, the Reese Viral here, and welcome to the re-LP of Dante's Inferno. This game is awesome. I say that about pretty much every game I play, but yeah, this one is really, really good. First things first, if you do not like seeing the tatas, titties, boobs, whatever the hell you want to call them, and I'd recommend averting your eyes on certain scenes. There's boobies right there. <laughs> yeah, I would normally censor, but motion, doing motion objects and stuff is a huge pain in the butt. Uh, shit, shit. Adjust your video settings so that each of the grayscale boxes are defined and visible. The square on the far left should be black and barely visible while the square on the right should be bright white oh so it's meaning don't have it there ew that looks gross i think that's good enough yeah the last one's barely visible let's do that christ in almighty okay so there is classic which is easy zealot which is normal hellish which is hard um, I'm just going for Zealot because I don't play games to show off my skill, I play games just to show them off. Even though this is a redo, but still. Um, I'm quite glad I'm redoing this game. I did think like when I was going to redo it, I would end up... Um, what is it? Censoring it, but after Metro Last Light, it's such a pain in the ass. In the year 90... wait... 1191 European Knights of the Third Crusade captured the city of Acre, about 30 miles from Jerusalem. Under orders from King Richard, 3,000 civilian prisoners were detained. They were held as ransom for a holy relic once taken by Saladin. What the fuck? You can read it. Screw it. I'm not good at reading quickly. As that obviously showed. Alright, it's on about Richard. I should shut up because there is talking. Here we go. I'll shush. Well, kind of shush. At the midpoint on the journey of life, I found myself in a dark forest. Hmm. For the clear path was lost. Oh, this is a grim scene. Stitching himself. Oh. It's the scream he makes that's the worst. I think that's his nipple. That would be enough to make any guy wince. I thought that was his flesh to begin with, but it's actually a cloth cross that he stitched onto his body. So, you know. Whoa! I don't know why he stitched it to himself. Like, what does that actually do? Is it to show that he's a holy knight? Holy Crusader. My family, my baby's gone. Crusader. And now the game begins. Yeah. Alright, bring it, you motherfucker. Alright. I'm just trying to remember the controls. Oh yeah, it's X is light attacks, A is jump. Um, Y is a heavy attack generally just a button mash like you know most games and I think the yeah the right analog stick is to dodge I'm pretty sure you can block yeah you can okay yeah it's just a lot of different different things I'm getting my ass beat by them cannonballs whoopsie I don't actually know if you can do like a um like a counter block so if you block at the last second if you can counter it um I really have no idea. I love this game. The combat's just awesome. Like most of these games, they're really good. Um, I don't know, I just have always liked them. It just reminds me of like God of War. Mostly God of War, because God of War's this kind of setting. 
like you know medieval and all that. I would say Devil May Cry, which it does in the combat sense, but Devil May Cry is not set in this time, so it doesn't really remind me of that at all. Oh yes, yeah, your boat. Well, that is a bit of an inconvenience. Thank you, you motherfucking cannonball. Oh, you can double jump. Ah, very nice. Hello, hope. I'm just like rolling around. I'm having so much fun with that. <laughs> no, you bastard. Well, we got stabbed in the back. That guy should be defined as a coward. <gasps> is that who I think? Death? Your fate is decided. Everlasting damnation for your sins. Damn. But that's not possible. The bishop assured us. Yeah, exactly. Death looks pretty weird, to be honest. He has a cross, I just realised. So he is like the Holy Crusader. The Holy Knight. I just realised. I need subtitles, which I'm pressing the wrong buttons for. Right, let's put on some subtitles, shall we? It don't matter. Okay. Are you done? I can try. He just has that th that move set pretty much to begin with. There we go. And it tells you a block. It's just a simple. I don't actually know if that hurt me. I like jumped at the last second. Damn it. Okay. Obviously, there will be some attacks that can't be blocked. I am blocking this. I'm guessing you can't do the whole, like, evade and then use block. It doesn't seem like you can. Anyway. Oh, he was gonna stab me. Oh, shit. Uh, I'd rather if you didn't. That's just a scripted event. Oh, shit. Hello. Yeah, it's just scripted for some reason. Okay, you completely missed. Okay. I don't even know where we are. Whoa. That was different. Are we like in limbo or is this like supposed to be purgatory? I guess. It could be. For fuck's sake, can you stop? Ah, that's the attack that can't be blocked. I mean like, I don't know just puts his scythe into the ground. Why is he so high up? Like, what the hell? I don't think I can cheat it, I think I can kill it. Oh shit, he's doing the same thing. I thought he only did that once. Ah, you are a dick, Death. You are a dick. Come on, he's gotta be nearly finished. Oh yeah, he is. Good. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, but it isn't. I love this. Yeah, fuck you. Your scythe is mine. Hello? Ooh. That's cool. Yeah, this is where we get like the really good combos. Right, let's finish off death, shall we? I'll do what I want, bitch. I absolutely love this. Yeah! Jesus. And that is what happened when you cheat death. 
you get loads of souls. <laughs> oh, that was such a cool fight. I always love that. Just because it's such a weird concept. Like, facing death. Like, literally, facing death. Yeah, it sounds like he lied. Oh yeah, this is the first scene where there's boobs, by the way, so... Beatrice. Hmm. That fucking cross looks painful. Ooh. And here we go. There's a dead crow. There's a dead guy with a cross in his face. Oh dear. Look at that soul patch. Who is that anyway? Okay. Oh god, he sounds... He does not seem happy. It's obvious what he's seen. He saw... The boob. No, she died. I don't even remember how. You find out later in the game. I know that. Beatrice. Well, she has chin hairs. That is high def. Hmm. Holy tits. <laughs> I mean, holy moly. Oh god, this doesn't look good. This game just took a dark turn. <gasps> I have to go with him, my love. I gave my word. Bye. Through the forest she goes. Yo, shouting doesn't help. In the slightest. And now we face some enemies that rise from their grave. Oh yeah, I forgot you can pick them up. Oh, that was cool. Oh yeah, yeah. And there's the dead Beatrice. No, ho, ho, my beloved. Ugh. I don't. I think every enemy awards you with a certain amount of souls. These enemies give you ten if you kill them, or when you kill them. And unlike most of these kinds of games if you grab an enemy it's not an instant kill or at least it isn't yet I think it is actually uh, later on once you've gotten a certain item but for the time being it isn't that would make more sense launch prison hold Y to launch nearby enemies into the air okay screw you you dick Oh, that's cool. Yeah! Is that everything? Can we go? There's an upgrade available. You have now collected enough souls to purchase an upgrade. Okay. Let's purchase something. Okay, now we have two trees. At the moment, we only have the unholy path available for us. Because the holy path is locked until you get a certain item. Which we'll get in within the next few minutes, I'd say. Um... But yeah, as you can see, on these trees they include multiple different things, such as different attacks, you know, chain attacks, stuff like that. And then there are some that just give you like a health upgrade, like that. The health upgrades and stuff tend to not be linked to anything, so like that's a health upgrade, that's a mana I increase, uh, that's a redemption call. Redemption is the, bot the bar in the bottom left. And then, I think there's four health upgrades uh, in total. I think so. But we'll learn more about everything uh, later on. So, yeah, I need to learn something first. Oh, there you go. You can counter, but you need 1,500. I can get the Impaler. Or Vile Wind. Um, I think I'll get that. Yeah, why not? Right, let's go. 
onward to infinity and beyond. I don't actually remember when this game was released, but I don't honestly think the graphics are that bad for its time.